Well, hey, y'all, I'm enjoying the little nip in the air. Aren't y'all? Yes, ma'am. Feels so good. Got the fireplace on. Christmas is behind us. And I'm going to make us the best little dessert, Michael. Don't you like sats satsumas? Say that again. Satsumas. S-A-T-S-U-M-A. Satsuma. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> yeah, it's yeah. fruit. You don't eat much fruit. But this is going to be so good. You're going to love it. And it's easy to put together. It was actually in my November, December magazine, uh, like the Christmas magazine. And I'm going to take eight ounces of softened cream cheese. I'm thinking about making this for my New Year's dinner. Yes. Because it will be wonderful for me. Uh, Perfect. And it, you, it'll hold in the refrigerator for like two hours, y'all. My seeing. It's easy. So easy. So easy. And the satsumas are they are at their prime, I think, right now. I should have sprayed that. So it come out good on its own. But I didn't. So there we go. So we're just gonna beat this until it's creamy. All right, so I'm going to set that aside, y'all. And I've got some wonderful pears that I'm going to slice. I'm going to squeeze some lemon juice on these so they weren't won't turn brown on us. And you'll want to just kind of toss them, toss them around and coat them. Oh, good. Now you could do these in cubes like this, or you could do like a whole slice so I may do I may leave a slice just to put on the top for garnish but the rest I'm just going to dice up I'm going to add a fourth of a teaspoon of vanilla extract to my cream cheese and then I'm going to hit it with my beaters one more time just to make sure that's incorporated. Perfect. You know, cream cheese, you just can't beat cream cheese. I love it so much. I, right. just beat it. I did, but I added some vanilla, so I wanted to make sure that was incorporated. You beat it. <laughs> I get it. <laughs> you is so funny. <laughs> All right, so we're just going to fold the sweetened whipped cream into our cream cheese and our honey. Doesn't that look good? It looks like a cloud. Beautiful, beautiful. All right, now I'm just going to put one together to show y'all. Now, we recommend using Anna's uh, Ginger Thins, Swedish Thins. And you can find them right in the grocery store. Uh-huh. Yep. Easy to find. Not a, hard, not a hard find. Nope. All right. I'll leave that right there. And now, I'm going to add... A layer of our whipped cream. Yep. A layer of pears. A layer of satsumas. Another layer of cream. 
I'm trying not to get it on, let it get on the edge of my cup. But that's going to be hard to do. I'll just clean that up a bit. All right, let's see. Need a layer, another layer of crackers. I just got where I just love ginger snaps, ginger cookies. They're so good. And the thinner, the better, y'all. All right. Pears. More satsumas. It's pretty. See how pretty that looks, y'all? Mm. The fruits are so good. And you can put as much on each layer. You know, all you do is the ginger snaps first, your cream cheese mixture, your fruits, more cream cheese mixture. And if you like a lot more cream, you can layer that real thick. <laughs> but I just think that's pretty and delicious. And you can use a pretty stemmed glass with it or a stemless wine glass. Whatever you've got that's pretty and festive for your dinner party. Please try it while the satsumas are in. Love and best dishes, y'all. Hey y'all, it's Paula Dean. Now, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to like it and click the subscribe button as well as the notification bell to be alerted when I post a video. Love and best dishes, y'all.